that a lot of, especially Korean teams, have made use of. Now they're going to be matching up. That was a charm from PK landing down. They may be in trouble. Cocoon lands back range there from Cyanide, but I'm getting a bit over. Just get rid of those big areas that you. Well, here it is. Six to five. They're going to dive straight in on top of him, but. No, not quite. They want there's a bubble there onto Reckless. And it seems like they've managed to force Fnatic away at least. But now there's the Culling oh. coming through, but actually hot. Now he's extremely low, and there's no reason for this turn push to stop except to teleport. Oh, that teleport coming down bottom. Yellow Star's on less than half HP. Here comes the reply, though. So as is going to come down. Yellow Star staying out of vision this entire time. Donnie's on to Peke. Flashing from oh, no. home. Oh. in here. The thing was, <laughs> two minion shots. Uh, that rage minion, what a hero. And what MVP. a <laughs> MVP of Fnatic's game so far. And that, I mean, take a cyanide presence. I think Lou have to back away. However, they have Spirit coming around here. The hook comes out, lands onto Heart, followed up by the Kukunu Kukunu down. Can they get in there? Spirit himself does have Flash available, and he goes free. They trap in Yellow Star, and will be able to get away. There hasn't been a massive amount of jungle pressure by either side, and he does have a bit of health advantage. Another charm! Diving straight in there. Can he finish off this time? Same okay. the Spirit Rush, the Ignite. Actually, as it pushed up over the halfway mark, it's just a level behind Dardy right now. And Dardy is going to die for him here. This is surely so as going to go down, but he's putting in some decent damage. Ignite will be used, but finish off on that. What? Hesitating and just going for the dragon. Here comes the teleport. Got to move in for this one. Yellow Star will flash. They get the hook up to Spirit. He puts the Cataclysm down. Charm comes through. They do manage to take down the dragon. Get them out now, but before Fnatic can make a play, they have to establish control of one side of the jungle to actually make that play on. So as walking right into darkness. Why? Oh, there's the bubble coming in. Spirit's gonna. They bring yeah, over. Knows they have to make a move. They have a numbers advantage on this side of the map. Oh, that's actually nice. On towards that. He's actually going to get the wild growth out of Acorn. The Kohli coming through. Reckless gets the one. Can they shut down Acorn as well? They do. It's a double kill for Reckless. And this tower is going to fall. Who's tanking it up? Fucking into Fog of War for Heart. Oh, they missed, they missed both. both of them. Everything missing. Everything missing. And Death trying to turn this one around. There is a tidal wave coming in. Cyanide dies in the middle, though. They managed to pick up Death. Spirit's in the front. It's going to be so hard they get one of the back. And now they're trying to chase out Spirit. To be honest, they could try and turn here and go towards Baron, but Spirit's still up there, still with this mic. You want to get him out of it, not let him even have a chance of getting in. Somehow still alive in this one. Finally gets hooked and controlled. And that's a win there for Fnatic. Like the 5k that you were talking about at 20 minutes. Whoa. Still further into this one. Spirit actually going to be caught inside his Cataclysm there. They went for Yellow Star in the first push. And there is the Cullen actually coming through. Spirit loses half his health. They force the, the wild growth out. Peke's going to come up big. There's a stun onto Akon. Peke blows him up as Dane goes towards Reckless. But he's just going to QSS that off. And surely will get the kill. He does pick Three it up. Kills. They've managed to kill off Spirit as well. Three men are down. I don't see Death escaping. It was a charm again coming out of Peke. It's time to turn and go Baron. Let's count the skill shots on that one. Because Fnatic hit everything they had on the ace. Heart's going here. He's going to splash away oh! through the bubble. He's exhausted, but he won't matter. And they got that pre-30 minute Baron. All right, let's count him here then, because they don't want to straight up one for one defend these. They try and get one turret, oh. they get him in. Oh, they landed the charge. DFG comes down, but they didn't follow through onto him. Peke was scared about going. So, Fnatic stepping up. Death trying to get that to hammer away. Oh, there's a cocoon there's one. going for Death. If they're going to need it, those waves just destroy it. Another one! Yeah. Coming up towards that! Yeah. They don't use it! They don't use it! Daddy! He's going to die to the middle of them! And he will fall so low there as well. Manages to just walk back into the base, but they've killed off the AD carry. Again, Fnatic decides. Screw it, let's oh. go! Oh, my rage! Onto Acorn! We'll get the one! Hard will be the next one! Fnatic could win the game right here! So many skill shots! It's a skill-based game! was just hyped up so much for his ability to dodge all these skills. Gone off, Cody. He's okay. not used it. All right. Oh, oh it. that a face check! Reckless unstoppable. Impact the difference between Peke and... Oh, oh. Spirit's gone free and they dove in. There's only three of them there. 
Fnatic. Yellow Star will come round. He's hooked a minion. Now the target he won. And now Dade is going to go for Reckless. What can he do? He's got a QSS. The death mark is, of course, gone. Not able to finish him off. And now we see Peke right in the middle of the group. So hard side towards death. He's now all alone. They're going to turn this one around. And so hard is the man to... They work around the vision that they know Blue has not feeding them any unnecessary information and keeping at least a few members mid to draw Blue's attention. To be confident about this one, they have to use the advantage that they've got going. There is Reckless stepping forward, the Cullen. We'll see about that. Peke does step forward now. And there is a Cullen coming Whoa. through. It's death that it connects onto. And that means that Fnatic have already got their inhibitor. So he does, oh, it's very good. He he down. Oh, last second wild growth. They got the tower and they're going to get Acorn. This could be it for Fnatic. Down they trying to get away. Peke goes massive. Gets the double kill. Two inhibitors down. Oh, Fnatic are going to win the game. No, they no. want to do it by the book. They've they killed go to the top. They've killed both solo laners, so the defense for the third inhibitor is near impossible. But they seem like they have the momentum. Big death timers. Third inhibitor potentially on the way. Death Spirit still alive. Fnatic stepping up once again. This time, Samsung Blue back away. So that's going to go towards Spirit. No stun. He's too healthy. Only gets the slow, but he'll force them away. Three inhibitors down for Fnatic. Super minions coming in through that bottom lane. There's another call in towards Death. They're going to try and get in. The hook pulls the minion. Can they land one of those big CC chains and lock a man down? This They're going in for the Nexus turrets. They get the first one. They just got to focus trying to hold it up. We've still got 15 seconds for Dade to come up. There's the second Nexus turret. Peke using a last just second stun. Fnatic are fighting here. Is it going to go well for them? Is it going to go that hey. way? They finish it up. And Fnatic take down Samsung Blue. Can I just say that Peke showed up and proved everybody this game that he still has it. They let Dade on Zen, and he went into that counter-pick in mind.